Alrighty, well hi everybody. Uh, this is Bo Flores again with Nightlife KC uh, for the Nightlife KC vs. Food Challenge Episode 4. Uh, today's challenge brings us to Kansas City's Waldo District off of 75th and Warnell where we are going to be coming to lose Barn Grill for the Bubba Boot Challenge. <laughs> this was kind of serious to be honest with you. I'm a little bit nervous about it, but it's okay. Um, let me go ahead and come inside. I'll explain the whole process to you. So come on and join me. We'll make this happen. Hi there, my name is Wyatt Crable. I am with Lou's Grill and Bar here in the Waldo neighborhood of Kansas City. And today we will be preparing our Bubble Lou for a Bubble Lou challenge. The Bubble Lou consists of three 8 ounce uh, Angus beef patties set onto a bun with a full setup consisting of romaine lettuce, a slice of tomato, pickles, grilled onions, and Wisconsin cheddar cheese spread. Got the cheese melt on the inside here. A little nice and gooey gooey. Stacked up. So cooked to a little bit of a uh, medium rare, medium. They need a long toothpick to hold this whole thing together. There. We'll leave it aside of fries. Here's the bubble of the challenge. Well, uh, the air is going to touch that. And then it was knocked out on the roll. Well, by the time the play was over, from already not getting up on it, eventually knocks it away from, from two and eight. This is the challenge. This is Doff Boot, 84 ounces of beer. This is Bubbaloo, 24 ounces of just beef patty. Um, two pounds of food, all in all. Um, the rules are, no one else can help you. Don't break the boot. Um, the record was set by Randy Santel. It's four minutes, 59 seconds. Quite impressive. Um, let's see what he can do. Folks, hi, this is Bo Flores again with Nightlife KC versus Food. Uh, where tonight we are brought to our fourth installment at Lou's Barn Grill in the Waldo District of Kansas City. And here today I'm going to attempt the Bubba Lou's Boot Challenge, uh, which as you can see here consists of a very enormous hamburger. Uh, we're looking at three eight ounce patties. Uh, in between we're gonna have some uh, cheddar cheese topped off with some lettuce, tomatoes, have some onions on the side, some pickles, and a side of fries. Looks pretty delicious, but doesn't look very challenging. You know, we can kind of handle this okay, but here's where the trick comes in. Not only do we have to finish this, but we're also looking at 84 ounces of cold beer inside the Lou's Das Boot. And that's where things are going to get a little tricky. So, not only that, but then once you do finish this, you also get a Bubba Lou's Boot Challenge t-shirt to take home with you as a souvenir. So, excuse me, we'll let go ahead and commence and we'll make the magic happen. Gotta do this the right way. I think after enough challenges we've learned that this is gonna be the best way to go about doing it. See you in a little bit. Oh my god. Delicious, delicious. Put together. It's gonna be a long one. See you guys in a little bit. in right now, got the burger about done, not bad, it's actually a really good burger, really moist, I love it, pickles, hand cut fries, delicious, um, here when we're working on the boot, this boot is a beast, my strategy at this point is to just keep this for when I get a little bit thirsty, until I finish the burger, once I finish the burger and the fries, then I'm going to grab this beast, so I'm going to be in a, in a nice carb coma here, the next hour or two, but until then we're going to finish this up and make it happen. As 
you see here, we're looking at one last bite of the burger. It's been okay. It's been a long day. I'm okay with this. And actually, I'm okay with that too. Let's just make this happen and we'll see what goes on here. So we're doing this right now. We have some arm milkers right now. Excuse me as I try to finish this up. Alrighty, so we're here. Um, I got the last couple of ounces left on this 84 ounce boot. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting a little buzzed <laughs> on top of finishing the burger. And all of this, we have just a little bit left, and bam, it's gonna happen. So hold tight. Now we gotta turn it sideways, if you remember correctly. They came into this game fourth in the country, turnover margin. They're plus 16. They created the two turnovers. They don't have any turnovers at all. Russell Wilson on the year, only three interceptions. It wasn't supposed to be pretty, it wasn't supposed to sound good, but damn it, I did it. The Bubaloo's boot challenge has been defeated. So yet again, Nightlife KC versus food, Nightlife KC wins. Deuces. Oh my god. Got me a little bit of vanilla ice cream and some funnel fries topped off a little bit of powdered sugar because that's how fat kids roll. Anyway, as you can see, I have since put on my shirt and we have finished the Bubaloo's boot challenge. Full, drunk, and eating some ice cream. Great, that's how fat kids roll. Nightlife KC, out. Chocolate? Bye guys. <laughs>